This is an excerpt from The Loneliness of the Sasquatch, which is a transcreation from the work of Gabriel Rosenstock. It's a book-length sequence of short poems and um, was written to be a narrative of profound loneliness, but can also be read as a narrative of, of extinction or even a way of looking at um, minority language loss. Uh, in Gabriel Rosenstock's original, the Sasquatch or Bigfoot is male, and in my version, the Sasquatch is a female. The Loneliness of the Sasquatch Appearing out of mist as from a dream, strange creatures. The Sasquatch rubs her eyes. Will they flee on seeing me, these swans? Wolves, bears, humans, other terrors all dissipate in the roar of the waterfall. Lean on me, she whispers to a tree, sensing it's about to fall. Lean on me. A bird flits across the moon. For an instant, she thinks she's becoming bird, human, god. Looks down at heavy Sasquatch feet. For three nights she keeps the fire, nurses it, tends it, sings to it. When she drops off, it dies. At daybreak, her cry makes the earth tremble. In autumn, the river runs gold. She has seen this before, knows the world is an illusion, that nothing lasts. Her footprints vanish her breath too. There will be no trace of her at all. Yesterday's heron, his reflection spirited away by ripples. If I could go with you, where would you bring me, setting sun? Where are you going? Is it into the darkness? Then take me there. I know darkness. I will show you darkness. <laughs>